Here's another quick tip from Whole Latte Love. Descaling espresso on coffee machines is usually required maintenance. It removes deposits that can clog boilers and other components. Now, those deposits come from minerals in brew water, so a question we get all the time. If I use ultra pure distilled or reverse osmosis water in my machine, can I skip descaling? Hey, espresso and coffee lovers, Mark here from WholeOutDayLove.com, and the answer to that question, well, yes you can, but, and this is a big but, you probably shouldn't. I'll get to why in a second, and in a minute I'll tell you how you can, in some cases, get around descaling, or at least do it less often. So, why not use ultra-pure, mineral-free water in your machine? Well, a few reasons. The big one, it makes for horrible tasting coffee. It's rather like having corn on the cob without some minerals on it. You know, the world's favorite enhancer of flavor and blood pressure, that salt. Now, some people are okay with that, but for most it's really bland, and for drinking water or coffee, it's the same. Without some minerals, you get very flat flavor. In fact, the Specialty Coffee Association recommends a certain level of minerals in brew water, and according to them, it's all about maintaining the flavor. Now, another reason not to use ultra-pure water, well, it's a really good solvent. It's so good, in fact, that many equipment manufacturers advise against using it, not just because it affects flavor, but over time, they say it can degrade machine components as ultra-pure water tries to gain back the minerals it's missing. So, I mentioned there are some ways to get around descaling, and they all involve filtering the water to reduce mineral content. Now, that sounds simple, and many people use tap or pitcher filters, but do some research. We have yet to find a filtering water pitcher or tap-mounted filter that removes minerals. Most are particulate and carbon filters, which do remove chlorination and organic substances, so they will improve flavor, but they have no effect on scale buildup. So, what are your options? Well, for owners of high-end prosumer level plumbed machines, we recommend the BWT Best Max Premium Filter. It uses a five-layer filtration process, the key part of which is an ion exchanger which removes minerals that cause scale and replaces them with magnesium. That's a mineral which does not cause scale but has the same flavor benefits of minerals that do. It's a complete system that includes everything needed to plumb directly into your machine. For semi-automatics with reservoirs, there are a variety of in-tank filters and pads that reduce scale causing calcium ions. These types will extend the time between descaling but not eliminate it. For super-automatic espresso machines, using a manufacturer-recommended filter can significantly reduce and in some cases totally eliminate descaling maintenance. Most super-automatic machines come with a water hardness test strip, so you enter those test results into the machine. Then, based on that, filter use, and number of coffees made, the machine will do some calculations and alert you when it's time to descale. Using a filter in these machines can extend descaling frequency by a factor of four, so maybe every eight months instead of every two months. And with some machines, like many Jura models, proper filter use can eliminate descaling altogether. Now, in the end, filtering your brew water is a personal choice, but please, if you don't, be sure and keep up with descaling your machine. Like changing the oil in a car, it's the single most important thing you can do to keep your machine operating properly. Now, if you have any questions about water filters or anything coffee, be sure and ask in the comments below and I'll get you the answers. I'm Mark from Holatelove.com. Thanks for watching and I hope you'll come back soon for more of the good stuff on everything coffee. Hey, why not subscribe now for easy free access to more videos on everything coffee brought to you by Holatelove.com. Oh.